Kerrigan. Before we jumped, Hyperion tracked multiple Dominion signatures headed down to the surface. You're gonna have a surprise party down there. Scanning. Detecting Dominion forces and a Zerg hive cluster. Yeah, there must be an old hive here. I'm more worried about the Dominion. Ground team, this is Fleet. What is your status? Fleet, our base is set up and the Dragon Pulse Cannon is almost online. Roger that. Eliminate all stragglers as they warp to these coordinates. We'll return for you. Fleet out. That cannon will take out Jim's ship as soon as he enters orbit. He'll never see it coming. Set course for the Zerg Hive Cluster. I need an army. I can sense a mind controlling this brood. Who are you? My queen, I am Magdul, a brood mother. You created us to extend your control of the swarm. Have you returned to us? I'm not your queen, and I haven't returned. But I need your brood to destroy the Terran cannon right now. Most of my brood is with me. I can send them to you, but it will take time. Then send them. When they arrive, we'll tear down that cannon before Jim gets here. Meanwhile, I'm going to prepare this hive for combat. The Dominion would have tracked my ship and they'll be looking for me. All right. Well, let's uh, start by making some drones. This is what is it? Okay. Let's see if I can remember how to do this. The first thing I need is a spawning pool. <laughs> it's it's still up and about the tutorial. Okay, look, I don't ask. Ready it really me? likes its tutorials. It's like if you don't know Sleeping. about spawning pools at this point, and you're playing StarCraft Two on Brutal, then well, all, all hope all hope is lost at this point. Okay. Yeah. I hear you. So, um, you have the choice of making some zerglings. I don't recommend that. I actually recommend queens. And lots of queens. Queens are amazing in this. Command, we found Kerrigan. She's holed up in a zerg base. We're going in. Send reinforcements. The Dominion found us. They're going to hit us hard. Yeah, I hear you. So Kerrigan's gonna be like your primary weapon pretty much for most of this, because like that's why I put the two spine crawlers here. You do a bit of extra damage to Marines when you're uh I should make Zerglings from the larva at my hatchery. No, don't don't listen. That's terrible advice. Don't do that. I, I they're a little bit underpowered, I just don't like them, you know? I I would prefer Say again? Queens uh let's also get some uh, that's being Geyser, get an Overlord out. Remember spine crawlers. I can mutate them from drones. We require more minerals. When the Dominion arrived, they drove some of my brood into caves. They will rejoin us if we can kill the Terran soldiers guarding the cave entrances. Don't worry about these zerglings. I don't care about zerglings. You can harvest Vespine at maximum efficiency if you order three drones to the extractor. G gas is actually what you're mostly short on in this mission, to be honest. So, and that's why I'm doing it. We only have one geyser here, so, and we want to make we want to make a lot of we want to make a lot of queens. I'm gonna also poop down uh, some creep tumors because we move faster than the creep. Queens actually, surprisingly, not like Malay. Uh, they move fast, extremely fast. They're amazing. So uh, get used to using them, especially for these early missions. Uh, they really help out. Ready for action. So here we have like now. Now it's like more marauders, but you know, Heading as I said. Out. It's pull size guys. And the queens will help out. Uh, we do have one spore crawler, so we don't have to even worry about this. 
And now we're yeah. just gonna pump out as many as many queens as humanly. They heal each other too. Way more cost effective. Sweeping. It's Covering insane. Ground. I gotcha. So I'm gonna move up slightly here, and I'm Pushing gonna. Uh, I think I burned down right. this bunker. Yeah. Awesome. And we just take out the tank. Work to be done. Just that's what the that's what that side ability is for. It's to th take out like high valued targets. It's incredibly good. Covering ground. So I'll get like one more group of queens, and then Say I'll again? start to move out. There are more zerglings in this cave, my queen. Oh, uh, they're pointing out basically these caves here. If you go there, you'll basically get some some free uh, for units uh, but that's really up to you if you deem it as Dominion approaching from the north and we're gonna just move our spine crawlers I gotcha. at this point we have a force seriously to be reckoned with we require more any more gas though I love these little counters at the top we those are really cool I guess I'll get some zerglings You can you can make these guys float. To be honest, they're 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 effective against light units, so I would not be concerned in the slightest. All right, let's move out a little bit over here. Okay, we're gonna let that one burn. Then we're gonna get the second one. Uh, I probably should conserve our energy after this. Just I'm gonna spit. I'm gonna use it only on bunkers. I gotcha. Okay, we'll give it we'll give it just a good second. Actually, I can move both these back over here, and then. Okay, we're good to go. Pushing ahead. And they're gonna send Goliaths after me. Ground. Actually, let's, let's fall back to these vines that I just rooted. What is it? Okay, we're gonna just stun them for a second while these vines get, get into position. Pull this one back. Okay, a little bit micro. Not very good micro, but you know, a little bit. <laughs> and also, I'm gonna get some upgrades. Because upgrades... Uh, the upgrades don't don't carry on from mission to mission, but the uh, the unit specific upgrades do. Like all these people can burrow. Work to be done. Bring them down. There we go. Okay, Say and we'll just keep moving. And eh, there's little mineral pickups here if you really want them. Uh, I could have really used some gas pickups, but you know we didn't get that. I, I'm more focused on like things like marauders because like. Come out of hiding. I hate her voice. Alright, well, while we're here, uh, we have too much minerals, so we're going to actually go and get some more defenses. Yeah, I hear you. There is a large Dominion force on its way to the High Cluster. What is I could not even care less about these guys. Uh oh, okay, be careful. They even have a banshee, and I'm too slow to to, to maneuver my guys out. Right. Yeah, I hear you. All right, keeping those spore. I, I got to do a lot of creep spread because creep spread amazing. Look at this; these guys you. move incredibly good on this on this sort of terrain. Also, I should hotkey these. There are more zerglings in this cave, my queen. Oh, there's a tank there. What's her energy at? Okay, 42. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna wait for the bunker to burn, and then we're gonna we're gonna go straight in. A little bit of strategy yeah, involved. Okay, tank is each other. This is actually not on the. This is only on brutal. That saw this saw this crap appears. So, you know, if you're playing on an easier difficulty, you may not see this, which is kind of interesting. Um. Hard by itself, I did not find hard. Part of the brood. Rise, my children. I was not paying attention. These guys have it though. I'll just kill them. Alright, good stuff. Ready for action. Okay, we're not bringing these Zerglings with us. They're here for base defense. Nothing else. Because we might as well do bring like five more and just make a whole bunch more spine crawlers Heading out. Safety's off. I'm gonna conserve our energy so these fire bats honestly they're not gonna do a whole lot of damage I don't even think Ker Kerrigan doesn't even count as a light unit but that stunning ability amazing look at that I just I, I 
wrecked. Gotcha. Completely and utterly wrecked. What is it? All right. Covering ground. I wouldn't mind actually getting some armor upgrades. So actually, let's cancel one and get armor yeah. upgrade. There Ready we for go. Action. Pushing ahead. On the same page. And we're gonna just move back just so they have to come to us and the bunker's not gonna attack us. And that gotcha. did not pull that person the properly. Are tunneling to you right now. My brood will be there soon. And yep, there's Thor's. By the way, you can just hu you can just kind of hump your base. Um, I'm not, because I'm just, I'm a badass like that. Like, I don't, I don't really, like, it's boring just to stand in the base while I wait for reinforcements, so let's not do that, shall we? And get the Thor. The Thor is the biggest threat against me at this moment. And we, we got reinforcements. And Bucker's gone too. Look, within two minutes we got all, we got all these little, uh, these things to help us out and but we don't have enough more energy to, to get more of this crap let's just take out these guys and we're good now we're gonna just go back in our base ah uh, it's good enough whatever run away by the way, if Kerrigan dies, it's not a big deal. She just comes back to life. Something I didn't actually understand during my first run of this. You just kind of assume that the heroes are kind of important but to, to protect. They're valuable, but they're invincible. They, they never die. And they're, they're seriously overpowered at times. It's ridiculous. Yeah, those, 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 you see, that's what I mean, like, Zerglings have so many freaking counters that, you know, you kind of wonder, why bother? Because, like, they just all got smoked. You have to be very careful with them, so, yeah, I'm lazy and I don't really want to be. I'm just gonna let her energy regenerate. It goes, look at this, it goes pretty fast. And we got 10 seconds. I gotcha. Oh, uh, tanks. Those ghosts certainly like their sniping abilities. My food has come! They are yours to command, my queen! Perfect. Now let's get up to their base and destroy that cannon before Jim arrives. Oh, that's it for the time part of this mission. We require more Vespi. If you wish to command all of your forces in battle, there is a way to control them all at once. Yeah, I could do that. Or maybe I won't. This is Kerrigan. That works too. Can I go up here? Will it, will it, will it let me? Oh, there's a bunker there though. It's probably going to get annoyed at me. Whatever. What is it? Okay, so now you have a brilliant, brilliant force. Uh, you can still get pretty fucked uh, if, if you're uh, foolish and uh, take too many chances. It's gonna make one more come out. Well, I have a lot of, lot of supply. All right, so queens in the back. Uh, oh wait, no, let's get the zerglings out of here. There's so many, there's so many guys here. For fire bats. Okay, now we're good. So, Zergling's in front. Everyone attack. And keep note of Kerrigan, because there's gonna be some crap here that we don't like. Like these tanks. Target the tanks first. Uh oh. Okay, move her back. Remember, if she dies, not a big deal. Okay, we got what we wanted to. Within our primary hatchery, when you are near death, you will burrow to the hatchery to heal. That's all we want to do. Those tanks are annoying as hell. I have arrived. All of my brood is here to serve you. 
and we're really after the cannon here. Like, it's if, if you want to go pro and like, pr like, attack the. Oh, okay, we're we're dead now. We probably should move back. Oh well, that happens. We require more minerals. And I seriously don't actually have enough uh, people making. Let's try uh, that again. Oh, oh, move back, move back. Don't don't engage that. This happened my last time too. I did this. Uh, you're not really pressed for time at all because it's just like um, in this one you can just build up again and, and attack. Okay, I'm content with this. I got you. With Kerrigan, Kerrigan is extremely powerful. Right. Like she does Safety's like tw well 20 damage apparently. Sweeping. So we're just Coming gonna go around. target the the tank first because tanks. Okay, move back here and wait for them to come attack me. Alright. They're gonna keep rebuilding, so I, I wouldn't really bother. They're only things that are like threats, and yeah, and I love that. That psionic, that psionic thing is just like psionic. kinetic blast, I'm sorry. Is that what it was called? And we're just gonna focus things, this thing down and we'll win. Aha! She's such a pansy. Oh, I didn't destroy 50. One of the things you have to do is you destroy 15 structures before uh, before her arrival. And I, I, I kind of just went after all the the all the all rescued things. As, look at this. It's, you, you can do this on casual if you want to. So, like, do you really need me to show you how to do that? Not really. Jim, are you on this frequency? Jim, are you out there? I'm at the rendezvous. It's all clear here. I've been thinking about what you said. There's something dark in me, Jim. I need you. I need you to hear me right now. Security is assured. 
Good night, my faithful subjects. Navigation online. Destination, Zerg space. Confirm. Confirmed. So here you get a choice between two planets. There's Char, uh, which I'm not going to play the dialogue because I'm going to do it later. Uh, but uh, you get a Baneling and an Aberration. Um, personally, I would not go for this first uh, because uh, you, the first planet here actually has something much better. It's also easier uh, for Brood also. It's something to take note of. A Brood mother named Nafash took her Brood to the frozen moon of Calder. Recent reports indicate a Protoss presence there. There is a high likelihood that Nafash is fighting the Protoss for control of Calder. Her brood is believed to contain highly evolved, dangerous Zerg organisms. That's why I'm here. They'll either accept me as their queen, or I'll start killing them one by one until they do. What are you? I am Isha. Your Majesty used to store all her ideas, thoughts, and plans within me. Do you not remember? Yes, I do remember you. More importantly, you remember me. You are the Queen of Blades. I obey. Perfect. Summon the Swarm and prepare to move on Core Hall. The Swarm is in disarray and will not answer your call. Most Zerg on Calder are under the command of Broodmother Nefash. She seeks to create her own swarm. While she lives, the swarm will be divided. Not for long, it won't. Take us down to the surface. The scouts report that Nafash set up a hive on this plane, but abandoned it shortly after. She moved off into those ice valleys. That must be where the Protoss are. Apparently click myself. Cold. Hell yeah. Tell me about this Leviathan. It is the organism from which you command the swarm, and this is its nerve center. And it can take me to any world I wish? Of course, my queen, but our numbers are few. Before conquering other worlds, you may wish to reclaim your forces here on Calder. Leave the strategy to me. Now, what else can I do on this Leviathan? You can evolve and upgrade your swarm in the Evolution Pit. The creature Abathur can help you. Well, let's go to the Evolution Pit and check that out. What are you? Abathur, Evolve Swarm, Spin Strands and Sequences. Served Overmind, then served Queen of Blades. Now serve you. I am the Queen of Blades. Mm, different. Examining genetic strands, Queen of Blades was efficient. Ancient Zerg qualities. 
minor Terran influence. You, infected with more Terran matter, Grasper limb poorly designed, can improve. We'll give it back better. Don't touch me. Only focus is evolving the swarm. Seek perfection in all things. Work in Evolution Pit. Can review my work here. Can evolve units at any time. Start with Zergling. Swarm suffering on this moon. I thought you'd made my Zerg stronger than this. Calder as cold as deep space. Other than Leviathan, no reason to specialize Swarm for such cold. Is that an excuse? Wasteful to spin unnecessary adaptations. Complexity bad, not needed before. Needed now. We'll look for local fauna. Essence useful for Swarm adaptation. Do it. So, uh, we get mutations for all our units. Organism can be upgraded. Three distinct mutations available. Once chosen, we'll activate sequences within creature. Improve combat potential. Mutation choice, not permanent. Can alter at any time. So this is different from Wings of Liberty, which means I can select it and change it later. So this is a ton, uh, plus ton of maximum life, uh, which is which is nice. That's, that's a good ability. Um, I also get something where I can increase my attack speed by 50%, which means like a lot more damage if you want to have DPS links. And also metabolic loot boost, which is the upgrade that you'd normally get in uh, the multiplayer, which is kind of, uh, which is a neat one. But for me, I'm not really using these to tech. This is nice for getting surrounds really quickly if you have a lot of uh, Zerglings. I'm actually going to do this mostly because I want them to tank a bit. That's that's what I'm going to have them around for if I have them at all. I want survivability with my Zerglings. Um, you can follow me or you can do your own choice. Realistically, they're most of the time they're all uh, side grades anyways. So if you choose something different, that's fine by me. That's um, uh, My way is not the only way. But anyways, um, so that's all the time we have for today. We're done with this mission. So next time we'll do this uh, ugly ice planet. See you later.